Hey guys, Rexel here and welcome to the channel. So last week, Apple released iOS 14 to the public and the most notable upgrade was the inclusion of widgets. Now Apple's stock widgets are only limited to display information of a specific app, but you can't customize the color or for example, the photo widget, you can't display a specific photo or a specific album. And because of that, I'm sharing to you these eight apps that you can download and use instead of the stock app widgets. So our first widget is called the memo widget. And you can also change the background of your widgets. We have stock photos here. We have colored backgrounds and gradient backgrounds. And we also have pattern backgrounds. So you can write anything on your memo app. It could be a reminder or a list of things to buy. So the widgets have three sizes. And there's two extra widgets where you can add a new memo directly from the widget itself. So that's it. That's the memo widget. Color widgets. Now color widgets is one of the most compact widget that I have seen so far. So it's a widget that will display time, date, and the battery status. There's a lot of themes that you could choose from. You can choose from three different sizes, small, medium, and large widget. You can also edit the background. You can have it light, colored, or dark, color theme for that as well. And there are tons of fonts that you could choose from. And you can also change the background photo if you want a personal photo to be displayed on that widget. And there's also an option where you can display 12 hour time or 24 hours time and you can also hide and show the batteries. Our next widget is called photo album where it displays photos on a specific album that you want. So I have here two albums already and if you want to add a new album you can tap on the add album at the top or you can add your existing albums and add photos. Now you can choose the specific album that you want to display on the widget by editing the widget itself. Now we also have other options like apply dark mode or the changing cycles of the photo and if you want to show the album name or not. World Clock Now World Clock is one of the most beautiful and minimalist clock widgets I have seen so far. So we can add a new CT by tapping the plus button at the top. So we'll try to search for Bangkok. And you can also name these clocks whatever you want. You also have options for clock type such as analog or digital and the date formats and an option for a 24 hour time. So you have a lot of option for widget sizes. And this is how it looks like with digital time displayed. Now if you're into aesthetics, I believe that the colorful widget is the widget that you need to install. As of now, they have five themes available and I hope that in the next few weeks they would install more themes because they are all looking gorgeous. Now you can also edit the themes but you can't do much if you are not subscribed to the pro features. So to come up with a theme, you have to add the widget one by one from the time, the quote of the day, and the photo widget. And that is colorful widget. Now our next app is called Widget Smith. Now we have options here on what to display on our widget. It could either be time, date, and custom like photos, or a blank widget, or a text widget, a battery widget, a calendar, and so much more. You can also edit fonts, tint color, background color, and border color. Our next app is called Ermin. Now Ermin is a calendar widget app 
Now we can go to settings and change the widget color. You have tons of options here as well. Now our last app is called Flip Clock Widget. They only have two options here, the small flip clock and the medium flip clock. So if you want a minimal flip clock widget, then this widget is for you. So that's it guys. If you think that this video was helpful to you, please click the thumbs up. Or if you have any questions, please do leave a comment below. Thank you again for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!